caught me off guard a little bit. What's up, my grub lovers? I'm ready to get the grub on. You know that I am. It's your boy, Mr. Grub, back again with another video for you guys. And today, I'm trying something a little different. Lay's has come out with a completely different brand of chips. And I want to try them first, but I want to try them first with you guys. So, I haven't uploaded in a couple of days. You know, I've been under the weather a little bit, but uh, I'm back with a new banger, man. That's what I do. So. I'm not going to prolong it for you guys because I know y'all already been waiting on me, man. So, I'm going to make sure, you know, we uh, drop something for you real quick, right? So, like I said, you know, Lay's has come out with uh, different flavors of chips. You know what I'm saying? So, I saw uh, saw some and I was like, I got to try these. I got to let you guys know how these are. Just in case you guys haven't tried them. Because that's what I do, right? So, the first one I have here, you guys can see it is the uh, electric lime and sea salt, okay? Uh, so I'm expecting a heavy lime taste, not so much on the sea salt, but definitely a heavy lime taste. I'm not really big on lime flavor, um, but I really wanna see, based on the concept, if it tastes how they're promoting it to taste. So that's what we're looking for, guys. We're looking to see if it's exactly what they say it is, okay? So for, for, for some people who may like this, if it's exactly what they say, this might be a chip for you, all right? The second one we got is the Flamin' Hot Dill Pickle Remix, okay? So this is supposed to be dill pickle with like a jalapeno pepper. Um, so I'm expecting it to have a strong pickle taste, but also be extremely hot. Uh, based on the way the bag is, it kind of looks like it may be uh, kind of like a blend flavor where it's not too strong on either side. But we're going to try that out too. Like I said, I know a lot of people like pickles and they like hot pepper. So this may be a, a good choice for some of you guys. So we're going to try that out as well, okay? Also, I have here the Kettle Cooked Classic Beer and Cheese. Now, this one is going to be a little different for me. And I'm going to tell you why. I don't drink beer, okay? So I'm kind of, for me, I'm expecting this to taste really bad, okay? So for beer drinkers, a lot of people, when they have like the little parties they do crackers and cheese and stuff they drink their beer with it so it's not like it's a weird combination but for me it's just something that i wouldn't normally indulge in because like i said i don't drink beer i love cheese though so because they drop the beer in there i'm expected to have a beery kind of taste but also be cheesy so uh for you guys who like the party mixers this might be the one for you like I said, I'm expecting this one to be the worst because I, I don't drink beer. I think it's the worst taste to drink in the world. So, but that's just me. Last but not least, guys, we got the Bacon Wrapped Jalapeno Popper Duet. Now, this might be pretty good, okay? Because it has the jalapeno, but it also has that bacon flavor. And I'm pretty big on both of those. So, I'm thinking it's going to work out and actually be a pretty good mix. Um, out of the four, I'm thinking that's going to be the one that I like the best. But, again... Everybody's different. So you guys like bacon and with a little spice, this may be for you. Like I said, we'll see though. So first one first, which guys you think we should try? Let's try this one, okay? So it might be a little tart, but we're gonna try it. You know what I'm so it has a smell, I can smell the lime already, okay? Y'all know how I be. Just getting over cold, but I can still smell it. Need a chip. Definitely live. As soon as it hits you, you immediately taste the lime flavor. That's all you taste. So if you're into lime, this would be a good one for you guys. For me, like I said, I'm not a lime guy, so I wouldn't pick these, but it's not a bad chip. You know, I don't I don't hate it. I'm just not big on lime. So if you guys like lime, this is actually a pretty good chip for you because it's pure lime taste. That's all you taste is lime, okay? Now, for the flaming Hot Dill Pickle Remix, all right, we're gonna try this one. Okay, I 
smell the heat, but then I smell that pickle after. So this might actually be also uh, exactly how they say it is. We're gonna see though. We're gonna put it to the test, guys, because that's what we do. Chip. This one, you definitely get that hot, man. It hits you immediately with that after pickle taste. It's not a bad chip, actually. Yo, I actually like this chip. I know it doesn't seem that way based on how I'm looking, but I actually like this one. It's uh, very flavorful, and the hotness hits you immediately with the aftertaste of the pickle, but it's not too strong. So I definitely like this one. This one is a good choice for guys if you like the pickle taste with the hotness. I know some people do like the fried uh, pickle with the uh, hot Cheetos on it. This would be a good one for you. Both of these so far are exactly what they claim to be, okay? So, shout out to Lays for that. I'll give you guys that thumbs up because it's definitely exactly what you said. Right now, out of the two, I'm going with this one. That's just me, guys. I'm not gonna do this one because I don't wanna ruin the next one. We're gonna skip to this one, guys. Save the, the, the beer for last, okay? Because I don't want to get drunk in the middle of the evening and then y'all see me on, on my drunk side. I'm trying to keep that under wraps, all right? Really, nigga? So, this one is the bacon wrapped jalapeno popper, okay? If you guys ever had jalapeno poppers from like uh, TGI Fridays or something like that, they're actually pretty good. But they usually have like the jalapeno with the cheese, so this is a little different. Okay, you smell more of the bacon than the jalapeno but it does lead with bacon wrap, so that's not bad. The chip itself, how it looks surprises me though. You know, I would expect it to be a little darker than this, but you know, looks can be deceiving, so we're gonna try this one too. This is terrible. Ah, got he, <laughs> got <he. laughs> This is terrible. This tastes, it tastes completely burnt. This one is terrible. So it's crazy because I was gonna save this one for last, but this one is really bad. So this one tastes like you're eating something burnt, like you overcook something. This is, it completely has a burnt taste. This, I don't think anybody would actually enjoy. If you do, kudos to you. This one tastes nothing like it advertises, okay? These two do, this one doesn't. This one actually just tastes like uh, something burning, like eating something that's burnt. This one is, is really bad. Oh my goodness. So I'm hoping it doesn't get worse, <laughs> but we're gonna try this one, okay? The beer cheese. You guys gotta bear with me. I have a low tolerance to alcohol, okay? Let's see. I smell straight cheese on this one. But we'll see again. Because I smell bacon on this one, but it don't taste anything like bacon. So, let's see. Chip. Oh my God. Terrible. That's disgusting. As soon as you bite it, you taste the beer. This, uh, <laughs> oh, that's disgusting. That is nasty. Again, this is my personal opinion, guys. Now, some people like beer. You probably enjoy this chip. Some people, I ain't even gonna say burnt. They like the Cajun their food. This will probably be for you. But what I will say is, out of all of these, this is this is the one that tastes nothing like it's like it's advertised. This tastes exactly. Like it's advertised, this one and this one also have the same taste of exactly what they're advertised. Out of all four of these, the best one, the Flamin' Hot Dill Pickle Remix is the best one by far. Okay, guys? So if you want to try any of these and you want to go off of my opinion, this would be your best bet. All right? So I'm not going to finish these because, like I said, they're just not my common choice of chips. Um, but if you guys ever, <laughs> ever want to try, let me know. Uh, 
you know, there's other chips out there. I'll try those too. Just let me know. That's no problem. Uh, again, like I said, if you're going to try one, the best one to try is the flaming Hot Dill Pickle. I wouldn't try the other ones uh, unless you're really into the line. This one isn't bad. These two are a definite no, okay? So that's just my opinion, guys. Um, you know, comment below. Let me know if you guys have tried any of these before, if you tried any of the other flavors. I know they have a, a chicken and waffle one as well. I heard that one was pretty good. I, haven't, I, I didn't see it, so I didn't get to pick it up, but I will definitely try that one as well. Um, so you guys comment. Let me know if there's any other flavors, maybe some in your area that's not in mine, and i definitely try them out. Uh, until next time, you guys, don't forget to like and subscribe. It's your boy, Mr. Grub. I'm out.